channel focus talking about black soldier fly and today I would like to share about the fly cage and beside me here is the fly cage small fly cage I'm in the farm of Pak Rahmat yeah Pak Rahmat is one of my trainee and Pak Rahmat here on this farm integrated farm and Pak Rahmat is one of my trainee uh, two years ago and today I visit his farm and yeah just to meet and talk and share about our experience in farming and okay guys today I want to share about this fly cage and this fly cage used to produce the eggs Pak Rahmat used this egg to to produce the to produce the larvae here and he used this larvae as a feed for his livestock here. There's a free range chicken here. There's a duck. Okay, guys, this is the kind of fly cage. Yeah, very simple, efficient, and yeah, uh, very cheap. You can see the material here, this wood. Parhamat used any uh, this wood, not not new, uh, not even even new material. Yeah. Paramat use uh, this material like this wood and the wire mesh. You can hang the wire mesh like this. And this is the prepupa rock here. And you can keep the zip here to put and to take out something from this fly cage. You can put the zip from all sides, yeah. So you can easily to make you to operate, yeah. Sometimes you you feel the the prepupae. Sometimes uh, you have to take to harvest the eggs from inside, and just simple like this. Uh, actually, the measurement of the fly cage is related to the other uh, facilities in your black soldier flies farm yeah you will have uh, the bioponds where you produce and grow the larvae and then uh, you have to produce also prepupae as a seed to, ins to put inside here and as a seed uh, in the fly cage <coughs> you can make this large of fly cage six to eight percent of total your biopons uh, productions so you will have the proportional large of this fly cage this is simple and you can see the roof of this fly cage this is separate here between this this part and then the roof and the important thing is the roof must be transparent because uh, flies need uh, sunlight to support their activity they fly and then mating and then they laying eggs uh, females yeah females will laying eggs and uh, unfortunately there's no populations here because yeah, para paramat six was six for three weeks yeah so he didn't come and and he he, he has no much activity here in this farm so as you can see here unfortunately the population is empty here yeah 
<clears throat> but I I can share about this fly cage, yeah, but not populations here. But yeah, yeah, we have one here, flies, of flies here, still remain here. Okay, guys, and now I will check the chicken farm here, yeah, which is belong to Parahmat. This is the pellet machines. This is multiple functions. Uh, pellet machines and also you can it can be used to to grinder the material also it can be used to process your the material uh, to be a powder like cornmeal or something like that. You fill the corn here and comes out as a meal. Cornmeal and something like that. So it multiple functions. Free-range chicken. This is the kind of super variety of free-range chickens. And yeah, we're gonna talk with Pa Rahmat and his sons about these chickens. Yeah. 
I asked him to share uh, to you about this variety of uh, this kind of chickens. Hello, my name is Ridwan. Okay, I'm here in my farm, in my father's farm. I'm graduate from my school uh, yesterday, and I'm after that I'm here. I for I help my father to manage the farm. And in this place, I have dark and chicken, and there is a maggot. My chicken is a superior, superior kampung balit bangan chicken. Is a native native chicken as a result of innovation from the agriculture research and development agency of the Ministry of Agri Agriculture. Thank you so much for watching this video because this video is very useful for our uh, for our <laughs> Okay, the, this because this video is very useful for ourselves and for you and for you all and and for, for you uh, <laughs> for you watching this video who was watching this video okay maybe enough from us thank you for watching and last we say don't forget to like comment and subscribe <laughs> okay guys his name is Ridwan he just uh, graduated from senior high school and today he have his father mr. Rahmat doing activity here in his farm yeah and we talk about uh, he interest to make video also in YouTube because yes. he like to share yes. he like to learn so he said by making this video at the same time he also learning about farming about everything yes, so yes. this video will useful for him and hope will useful useful for all of you guys who watching this video Thank you and see you in the next in the next video video on <laughs>